What's up, y'all? We back on the dunk, man. Today, I'm actually going to finalize the document so we could be legal for the road, man. So, I woke up, getting all my paperwork together. I was like, yeah, we about to get some plates. Literally, I went to DMV yesterday, told me what I need for this. I was like, all right, bet. We gonna make it to the show. Due to Mother Nature, the show is canceled, so... I probably just finished the console and then that'll be it. Probably take it for a little spin. But uh, I got this cell panel trim, which I was like a thousand percent sure it was in the car. So was cash. And uh, yeah, it wasn't in the car. I went and checked my old video that I posted. It was not in the car. Thanks to Dump Rider Down. Got me together with the trim. I the next day eat it. When I really didn't need to have the next day. So this go on the same way as the other one. Yeah, go on like that. You can see. You can see that mess, man. This whole car gonna end up getting repainted for real. I don't even, I don't even care. This whole car getting painted. Because there's so many chips on this thing. And it's not a, a, a candy paint job, so... I ain't too much worried. And then it got a whole bunch of, y'all see it when I clean it, man. It got a whole, whole bunch of platinum pearl in here. Like like some uh, House of Candy platinum pearl or some kind of paste pearl. That's what they call it when I went to the paint shop. They like, uh, it's paste pearl in here. So, once I repaint it, I'm not putting no pearl in here. Because if I get a scratch or a dent, I want to be able to sand it, respray it, and then boom, maybe like nothing ever happened. Yeah, I'm not doing that. So, I got sale pound of trim. I'm gonna go ahead and bolt that on. Um, polish it, polish it a little bit so it could be a little clean like that. But everything back here is good. Out right, the next day, this trim, man, 155 dollars. Show canceled. Next day, Epic Center, Epicenter. So I get the base booming like it's supposed to. It was hitting though, Dang. but it wasn't hitting like it could. So y'all, y'all seen how the console was coming. So y'all just stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that, man. But yeah. Y'all was right. But I seen some, some stuff that's supposed to be able to get this out, so I'm gonna go ahead and order that. It's called it's called Meal Do 31. Press five. We got some four gauge welding cable. So I'll be saying it's bendable. Very flexible. This is what I'm gonna use for the four channels. Rerun it. So now at the show council, I got time to rerun most of these wires. And I got time to uh probably buy some more four channels because I don't want to use these for this car. Um what brand I'm going with, no clue. Absolutely no clue at all. Got a new epicenter. Y'all seen the one that come on. Next day, this two with Amazon. So we're gonna put this on right now. It's only uh these two that's already plugged up. Then that's already in there, so we can plug this up real quick. I like the way these boxes is right here. All you gotta do is fold it over. Then everything come out. I like I like that setup. With that heat wrap. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in real quick. Four screws, change over the cables, and we should be banging. Just give me a second. Just as I suspected. <laughs> that was my problem, man. But it was gonna went out completely. So, let's uh, see what we get. Man, I started raining. I was trying to cut this wood real quick. This is the number one reason why I need more space and, I was gonna say and or, but I need more space, period. Or a, a, a wood panel saw. For those who don't know, basically, a whole sheet of wood, like that. A whole sheet of wood, man, you could uh, put on the panel saw and chop it. 
And the panel saw is, I say like, the max, one and a half, two feet wide. And you could just have it against the wall and put your wood on and cut it. But right now, with the space that I got, I cannot lay a sheet of wood down in this garage. I always gotta take it outside, and right now it's raining, so it's like all the woodwork stopped every single time that it starts raining, and I can't cut a straight sheet of wood down. I gotta cut the sick, like I gotta make a shape or measure what I need, trace that on a piece of wood, then cut that out instead of cutting a straight piece down. I be hating it, man. It's so frustrating. Lack of space, man. This is so frustrating. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go to the DMV like I supposed to about four hours ago, three hours ago. And then uh, go ahead the plates, everything. I got my insurance card, all that situated. Big shout out once again to Carlton Powell, big supporter of the channel. Um, if you got an old school, it's called, let me let me check my email to tell you what it's called. American Collectors Insurance Company. So y'all check them out, get y'all some great insurance prices for a year but they only do old school so if you're driving your old school every day you can't call them you gotta give them the make and model of your daily driver they only insure old schools like you can't drive it every day so man they gave me uh 25,000 in coverage platinum towing service and then the same with my regular policy, the 300. Wow. Just did, uh, the parts on. See it on this dump. Yeah, I took a picture. I'm going to ask him in a second. The lights made a console for this. He be using the ashtray, so he got the console sitting all the way forward. Back on a junk at night. Uh, I said, hey, Look at that. We ultra bright. Got my second set in. We ain't got no problem seeing. I gotta get my light down now. The blinker. Get that situated. But yeah, got my second set in. Finally. Let's see. You know the bright set on there? What? Like like the Humvee? Yeah. See it, I wanna see what it do. Maybe it just turn turn one to set off. It's toward the bottom. Turn it back on? Damn, that, that, that thing cut one side off. <laughs> Good it is. Yeah, I gotta rewire some stuff. It cut three lights off. There you have it. What I like to do Ew. is if it was old, Ew. some old uh, material condition oh right after you wipe it. Oh. I don't know what she talking about. 